was designed by our friends at Saban. Saban, Brains. yeah, we didn't have the time or the resources here at Hyper, so Saban took over on that one. Uh, and I do, and on that note, like for those that don't know, I am the CEO of Hyper, so when it comes to like decisions that have to be made for Hyper RPG as a whole or revolving around the shows, you can blame me and have those discussions with me, and I'm all about talking about them. Um, Why did you try to kill my characters last week? Huh? Try to kill my players. Uh, dude, that was Kyle Higgins and JDF. Yeah, they they definitely contributed very much. <laughs> I just lo I love I was following the dice rules. Oh, I'm sorry. I like I'm like all right. Here's the scenario. And JDF literally interrupts and goes, I uh, kill them all. I know. <laughs> and like, oh, what? I love it. I love uh, it. But so I take his morpher and then Marv is just like, no, I'm gonna do a power move and a flip and I'm gonna do this other move and I'm doing this other thing and I'm gonna jump up here and, gonna, and then JDF is just like. So can I take his more for now? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so there's things like that where you're like, yeah, beautiful chaos. Uh, but as far as, uh, I see a lot of people in the chat room saying like, can you guys do this? Can you add more missions to the minigame? Can you upgrade this? Can we see the weapons? Can we do this? Can we do that? Um, I'm going to be really frank with you guys. Uh, you guys as an audience are absolutely amazing. The people who are watching the show that are talking to us, that are interacting with us on Twitter, you're all phenomenal. You're absolutely amazing but I want you to realize something as a business as the CEO of that business um, when we were in the first month of the show as a channel um, we got up to 2,700 subscribers we got as low as 2,000 a month ago and we've been trying to build back up um, part of the reason we say how important subscribers are is it's how we actually fund the channel and uh, the interactions with the supers the megas and ultras despite this being the most popular show on the channel it actually makes us the least amount of money and we lose money on every episode uh, from just a CEO standpoint and this isn't your fault this has nothing to do with you this is just it's a business and we pay people that work here we pay all the people on the show we pay the crew we give the crew health insurance all those things um, so we can't oh, afford hey thank you for yeah. subscribing uh, yeah, we please. can't necessarily afford to do all the things that we dream and want to do because all those things take time, time is money, yada yada yada, and, so on and so and on. And I also like to say I'm very proud we want to do a lot. Uh, associated with Hyper RPG because we don't like abuse artists though, we, we do pay We pay them, the artists too. You know? yeah. We pay our artists. Even, even, when we, even when we have fan artists do stuff for the show, we pay them. Right. Oh, right. I, I got you guys right here. Um, here's the thing, I don't know how this works yet, you have to tell me. What's the next amount of subs that you would need to get another emote? Oh, <laughs> you don't want to know. Oh, it's, it's, a, it's a lot. Well, because we had so many before. Yeah. You know how, like, on Twitch, it unlocks at a certain level. Luckily, they don't take them away when you go back mm -hmm. down. Because oh, we, we got go. up to 2,700, we filled them up, oh. and then we lost and went down. We'd have to get up to 3,250 sub points. All right. And the highest sub points we've ever had was like 2,900. Okay. So they do it by sub points now instead of subs actually. Like the higher oh. tier subs count as more points. Okay. Um, so it's a long ways I'm, away. Okay. A long ways away. I'm just saying, we got a six ranger. Yeah. <laughs> It'd be cool to have a six emote. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, gonna, uh, I'm going pipe dream, man. I'm I just know, saying. I know. But I, I, know. Wanna, I do want to say like right out. and Because the last time, I get nervous about talking about this stuff now that we do the Power Ranger show. As a network and as the CEO of this network, in the past, I've always been so open with the audience. We do an honesty hour segment. We talk about our finances, where everything goes. This is a new experience because the last time I tried to talk about this stuff, somebody clipped it, took it out of context, and then used it to kind of create their own agenda of like, look, another Saban thing is failing because Saban won't listen to us. And it's like, whoa, 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 whoa. That is not what I'm saying. As a show, I deem this a success. Everyone on the show deems it as a success. Behind the scenes, Saban deems it as a success. Um, seeing something as a success is a lot different than is it generating you know, enough revenue. Uh, those are two very different things. To us, this has been one of the most amazing experiences we've ever done. Uh, the story and getting to work with all, everybody, getting to work with this cast, getting our friggin' we're on the comic book. Yeah. Yeah. Holy shit. That's, it's a success. Yeah. And it's a success. on the front cover. On the front cover of the comic book. So, um, I feel weird because in the past I've always been really honest with our audience and told them exactly how things are going. Now I have to be a little bit more guarded because I don't want people to take things out of context and use it to fuel their own agenda and their own history with the IP that we're working with. Uh, but if you guys have direct questions, I'm always available. 
Um, you can ask, you can tag HyperRPG on Twitter. He you can talk to me. I answer night. questions all the time. She, yes. Uh, when I play single games, I'll answer what I can without it being too distracting to the game, of course. Uh, and I do honesty hours to answer those questions more deeply. But be aware of some stuff. I have to be a little more careful than usual because I, I don't want to create any weird kind of stuff. But 